Hey YouTube, it's Jess here, and today I am reviewing Frog Morton's Across the Pond. And I have to say, this is the first time I've smoked it, and I know some people are like, okay, well, you know, smoke a few bowls and then see how you like it. Right away, this stuff is delicious. It tastes so smooth, it's unbelievable. Maybe you might change my mind during this video, but so far, it's so smooth. Anyways, okay. So I picked this tobacco out of all the froggies because it has Syrian Latakia in it. And Syrian Latakia is not being produced out of Syria anymore. From what I heard, it was because of some sort of fire or, or something. Something happened to all the Latakia, uh, the crops. I think they were all like ruined, so they stopped. They stopped uh, making it. If, um, please correct me if I'm wrong. I could be wrong. I think I read that in, in a news article or something. But if I'm wrong, that's fine. Uh, but yeah, they're not. They're not. They're not making it anymore right now. So all the stuff that's in America right now that has Syrian Latakia in it is like Frog Morton's. There's a couple, a couple other blends that that have Syrian Latakia in it. But this one, right on the tin, it says you know it's got the the well-renowned you know Syrian Latakia inside it. So. Out of all the froggies, I picked it because of that, because apparently it's the best. Anyways, unbelievable taste. Again, uh, my nose is still broken, so as far as flavor, I can taste sweetness on my tongue, but it's not sugary. It's just a smooth hint that takes from the spice. There's no spice at all. It tastes almost... I'm not getting the campfire taste, actually. Usually I'm used to that campfire taste, but uh, I'm not getting it this time. It's just so smooth. It tastes exactly how I want a tobacco that doesn't have any flavor to it. Taste. This is what it tastes like. This is the best English I've had so far. It tastes earthy. This is weird, but it tastes like I'm walking through a forest. That's what it tastes like. That's the way I explain it. It tastes like I'm walking through a forest. I like that. Anyways, um, gotta try some more tobaccos pretty quick here. There's a lot to try. I know a lot of people said that um, that they don't like smoking in the in the in the summer. Why? Uh, because it's hot and they don't like it and it just doesn't feel right. So pipe smoking is more of a winter thing. I honestly have to say I'm more inclined to go outside if I don't have to wear a jacket. So I prefer smoking in the summer. I, I was uh, out in Chilliwack for the weekend with my friends again, and I, we went to the lake, not to the same lake that I brought you all to, but to a closer one to my house called Cultus Lake, and we sat on the dock, there was people everywhere, and I lit up an aromatic tobacco, and me and my friends shared it, and they loved it, said it tastes like chocolate, it was amazing. I couldn't taste it because I was still sick, um, but they loved it, and yeah, sitting in the sun, smoking a pipe, that's the way I like it. Right now, if anything, uh, obviously you can't tell, it's pretty outside, it's nice and sunny, but uh, it is cold. It is, it's cold right now uh, in the shade. In the shade, not in the sun, but in the shade it's cold. So I'm not a big fan of the cold. I'm like one of those girls that wants a blanket on all the time. I like being warm, um, but I am a fan of, of, of smoking outside. I can't wait when it's like 12 in the afternoon, I'm barbecuing outside here on my deck, and then smoking a pipe. I can't wait. As soon as I get the chance, as soon as I get a barbecue, <laughs> then I'll, I'll do that for sure. This tobacco really makes me want to uh, to try all the Frog Morton from, by McClellan's right away. This one is amazing. I absolutely love it. So far, it's holding its its flavor. That's hold, not holding its smoke too well, but that could just be my pack job or my pipe. 
seemed pretty dry out of the tin. I just opened it up a few days ago, let it air out. Um, seems like a good consistency, a little drier, more than moist. I have changed from the more moist tobacco down as I gradually smoke more tobacco. I do prefer it to be a little bit more dry, um, as uh, at least seems like a lot of people do. That just comes with time, right? Just the new habits that you get. I'm pushing 300 subscribers, and you know what that means when you get to 300 subscribers. You're at 300 subscribers. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, I am getting ready to have my first contest. Um, there's a contest going on right now where they stole my idea. That's okay, Mark. That's okay, though. I'll think of something new. And uh, I got a, I've been taking a lot of time talking to my friends and trying to think of a good prize and uh, something that uh, that will invite everybody to join my contest for my 300 subscribers. Um, still mulling over the details, I'm not quite there yet, so I don't plan to start any sort of contest or get any sort of official date or idea or, or anything out until I hit the 300. It's not, I don't see a point until you're actually there, right? 300 is 300. So that's coming. And, uh, I know, like, again, don't get mad at me, guys. I know that I want to get out to Vancouver and show you some spots. I got Stanley Park, English Bay, and, uh, and Yale Town, Gastown. There's a bunch of really cool spots in Vancouver. Even just down the street, if you can see the water, the whole water, the whole water line, it's uh, Fraser River, that's like the ocean. The Pacific Ocean is just connected to the end of that. And this whole place we call the Key, and it's beautiful in the summer, so I gotta go down there too until the video. Uh, there's just places all over the place that it's just unbelievable views, great scenery, lots of trees in the city, it's beautiful. So I, that's my summer plan. We're not quite there yet. I still got family here, my cousin is still here, uh, you know, people, people are still hanging out. We got trips planned and uh, stuff. So I'm going to get those videos out. So make sure that you pay attention to my channel. They will be out soon. It's out again. All right. Anyways. Uh, that's all I wanted to say for today, so I'm going to enjoy the rest of this pipe, enjoy some dinner with my family, I love food, and, uh, and we'll see you in the clouds. Have a good day, guys. Bye.